Hi everyone, I'm Ross from Life Fitness. I'm here today at the Peak Gym in Stirling. I'm going to show you guys how you're going to get set up on the cardio equipment, how you're going to be able to log in, track some workouts and use the equipment we've installed here. Okay, so first of all you're going to want to get set up with uh, an account for the Halo Fitness Cloud. You can speak to one of the team at the Peak in Stirling and they'll get you set up in a short 15 minute appointment. Then once you get onto the cardio equipment you've got a few different ways to, to log in. Um, you could just manually quick start uh, if you wanted or ideally you've got your new Peak wristband and you just tap that against the machine, that will log you in. You'll then see your name appear on the right hand side and know that you're logged in. You can then choose what kind of workout you want to do, you can choose from some in your exercise library or some of the Lifescape courses we've got built into the scenery. So if I just choose one here as an example for you, select uh, what I want to do for 20 minutes, press and start. So the treadmill will start moving, you're off on your workout and we've got Run Social in the background here so you'll see some other avatars of other people who are also in this Montreal walking course at the moment, they might be walking or running. As you see the light, the landscape changes, incline or decline, your treadmill will also change incline or decline to match what you're doing so it can be transformed into some of the, either the world. You can choose if you want to go faster or slower and there's a nice little feature here where you can go from a walking pace to a quick brisk jog pace right up to a sprint pace at a nice quick tap of the button. Once you've completed your workout you're just going to press pause, end the workout, go into cool down mode if you like and that's going to save and record all your workout data into the Halo Fitness Cloud that you've created at the start of the, with the team at the peak. You've got some workout data at the end, you just hit an end to confirm and go back to the start position.